Today we start the process of transforming this calf into a steer. Please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. In this week's video, we're going to show you the ins and outs of applying a castration band to a calf, turning it into a steer. So why don't you just sit back or lay her down and relax and enjoy the video. First things first, here are a few reasons why castration is necessary. Bulls are very powerful animals. They also can be very dangerous to humans and to other bulls that you introduce into the population. Castration reduces the production of testosterone, which makes the animal less aggressive, making it easier to introduce new bulls and makes it much safer for the handlers to be able to go in there and actually do their job of feeding and taking care of the animal. Another benefit of castration is the flavor of the meat. Some countries like Italy prefer bull meat, but the vast majority of the world prefers steer meat. This is the tool that applies the band. It's called an elastrator, and what you do is you put the band over them four prongs and then spread it. This is what the band looks like before it's stretched. They come in a bag like this of about a hundred or so. It, it doesn't say specifically, but uh, it says a hundred, a hundred plus. Um, so yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to grab it. We're going to slide it over the four prongs. There's a little lip on the four prongs. You want to make sure you get it down to the lip because if you don't, when you go to stretch it open, the band's going to snap off. Now that it's on there, you go ahead and stretch it open. And at the bottom, there is a little clip that you can flip into place to hold it stretched open so that you can maneuver and work it around so that it's not closing when you don't want it to. For demonstration purposes, I went ahead and filled a black sock with two marbles to simulate the sack of the bowl. You're going to shove the two testicles down into the elastrator, making sure that both testicles are indeed below the band. You're going to release the clip at the base and close it up. As soon as it's closed up, you want to quickly roll it off because the bowl is not going to be happy, and then you remove the elastrator. Then you quickly check to make sure that both testicles are indeed below the band. What happens next is circulation is cut off and the testicles slowly begin to die off. After a couple of weeks it'll fall off and heal as if there was nothing ever there. Now it's time to get down to the action.
As you can see, the cow is no worse for the wear and still giving love to the owner. The owner goes around the back to check to make sure all went well, and indeed it did. Now the calf can start the process of the castration, and before you know it, it'll be back to normal and this will just be a memory. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. It really helps in advancing the channel. For your viewing pleasure, here is some bonus footage of some goats sparring. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next week.